Hey YouTube, what's up? This is Ben from ShouldIGetIt.com and in this video I'm going to show you the difference in bokeh or the blurred portion of your photograph when you're shooting with a crop sensor or with a full frame. So I'm going to shoot a picture of this 5D Mark II with my T2i with a 51.8 and then I'm going to shoot a picture of the T2i with the 5D Mark II with the 51.4 at f1.8. So I'm going to use the same exact settings on both cameras except of course this one's going to be actually 50 millimeters it's going to be more of an 80 which I talked about in my previous video check the description for that link but right now I just want to show you what those photos look like so let's grab the T2i and we're simply going to take a picture of the 5D Mark II now I don't usually use live view but just to show you I'm going to focus and take the shot so let's turn that display on there you can see the shot the depth of the field is pretty good. The focus spot is definitely on the lens. You can see that right there. Everything else is somewhat blown out, but it's still not the narrowest depth of field, even though it's shooting at basically 80 millimeters. Now we're going to take that same picture with the 5D Mark II. Let's move that over. I'm going to take the same thing, turn on live view. Open it up. And that's good framing. Let's take it. There we go. So let's press play. And now you can see that the depth of field is much narrower on this image. Hopefully, you can see that right there because it uses the full 35 millimeter sensor. So, really, what you get in focus is just the lens and even the side of the camera is blown out so even behind the lens you can see that text there is pretty crisp but the text on the back of the lens is starting to blow out however on the picture we took on the T2i if we take a look at that you can still see that all the text on the lens is in focus so you definitely get a much narrower depth of field on a full frame camera and a much nicer bokeh these are both shot at 50 millimeters at f18 except this is on a crop sensor of course so that was the second video if you have any more questions about full frame versus crop sensor let me know but that's it for now see you guys in the next one peace